Published 1730 Eastern Standard Time, the 9th of March 2018. Updated 1857 Eastern Standard Time, the 9th of March 2018. An England boycott of this summer's World Cup would prevent Vladimir Putin from getting away with a poison attack on British soil, a top authority on Russian security told Sports Mail on Friday night. Dr. Calder Walton of Harvard University's Kennedy School of Government said that the British government cannot allow Putin to escape reprisals over the attempted murder of Sergei Skripal in Salisbury, in the way he did when Alexander Litvinenko was murdered in London in 2006. It took 10 years for an inquest to rule that Litvinenko was probably killed on the Kremlin's orders. Vladimir Putin is under fire in the aftermath of the Salisbury spy nerve agent attack. Dr. Walton said, There are grounds to say that much more must be done this time, if Putin is found to be behind the attack. A boycott is possibly the kind of statement needed. There's a good argument to say that England's participation in the World Cup validates Putin and gives him credibility, Dr. Walton said a more potent course of action may be sanctions, cutting off diplomatic ties and freezing of Russian assets in the UK, but the case for an England boycott has been supported by Tom Tugend Hat, chairman of the Foreign Affairs Select Committee, and Chris Bryant, chairman of the all-party parliamentary Russia Group. A boycott could see England banned from the Qatar 2022 World Cup. It would breach rules which state, all participating associations must play all of their matches until eliminated from the World Cup. Sportsmail revealed McDonald's is considering reducing its presence in Russia this summer. Article 6 of the same rules states a withdrawing nation could face sanctions, including the expulsion of the association concerned. From subsequent FIFA competitions, yet the tournament's major sponsors have thrown more doubt on whether they will honor deals with FIFA in the aftermath of the Salisbury spy nerve agent attack. On Friday, Sportsmail revealed McDonald's is considering reducing its presence in Russia this summer. Budweiser and Kia have now refused to confirm whether they will honor their deal. Budweiser are awaiting the outcome of a police investigation before making a decision. Former England captain David Beckham walks out with a mascot during the 2002 World Cup. Kia said they are reviewing whether Russia is safe. No trips have been planned, said a spokesman. The other sponsors, Hisense, Bevo, Mengnu, Coca-Cola, Qatar Airways, Visa, Wanda and Gazprom, all declined to comment. Alisher Aminov, president of Russia's National Fund for the Development of Football, told Sportsmail he was astonished FIFA is allowing the nation to host the World Cup. He said there was not even a chance for Russians, millions of whom are deeply impoverished, to decide whether this was the way they wanted billions of pounds to be spent. Additional reporting, Adam Crafton, Kieran Jill, George Clark wives and girlfriends of England stars will not be out in force in Russia due to security fears.